Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What is risk pooling in supply chain management? Imagine you're planning a huge party with dozens of your closest friends. You're in charge of the snacks. You could buy a bunch of different treats, hoping everyone will find something they like. Or you could pool your resources with a few other friends, sharing the cost and variety. This way, you're more likely to satisfy the snack cravings of the entire crew with less waste and expense for each of you. That's the essence of risk pooling, but in the world of supply chain management, risk pooling is a strategy used to reduce uncertainty in supply and demand. It involves consolidating risks across various locations, products, or services. By doing so, companies achieve a smoother flow of goods and minimize the risk of stockouts. Think of it as a balancing act. Instead of one warehouse stocking up on a single product, multiple warehouses carry a mix. If one location sees a sudden spike in demand, others can quickly step in to fill the gap. This strategy requires coordination and collaboration. It's all about sharing inventory information and forecasting demand together. Companies can respond more effectively to changes in the market by pooling resources. In essence, risk pooling is about being prepared. It's like having a plan B, C, and D. If one approach doesn't work out, another one will. This flexibility ensures that customers get what they need when they need it. Supply chain managers love risk pooling because it can lower costs. Less stockpiling means less money tied up in inventory. And less overstock means reduced waste and losses. Ultimately, risk pooling makes supply chains more resilient. It's about working smarter, not harder, to ensure that the right products are in the right place at the right time. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.